what I do is I trigger the kick and the snare, but there's no real triggers on, on the kit, there's only mics. <laughs> music production you may have heard of drum replacement and software to, to that effect to help you facilitate replacing these drum parts um, after the fact after you've got recorded part I actually did this live and it's much fun it's so much fun uh, it's so, it's really creative it really helps me to sort of uh, think outside the box <laughs> I was bored with just having one single triggered sound, a synth sound or a pad sound or something. Um, it's just really static. It's just bam, boof, there it is. One note, one note, one note, one note, which works for some some things. But if you want to like improvise, like, like you've just seen, um, find a way to trigger MIDI notes uh, in a sequence just for one static note. Actually what I do is I take a, an Ableton rack uh, with a fast laptop or Firewire and um, latency is like way down but that, that's the settings, that's the technical aspect but basically it's an Ableton rack and a little piece of software by Cohen called KT Drum Trigger <laughs> parts of that you get a clean mini note so from the bass drum you don't want the trick the other the, 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 especially the bigger toms essentially what I've got is a frequency tuned mic audio signal on the front end of my uh, rack um, and then it goes into a few different Ableton components which splits it down so that um, you, know, you can have like sort of 1 to 16 steps if you if you want you could trigger a different sound <laughs> samples you can trigger anything and I, I really happen to like triggering actual synths soft synths and I'm going to go through um, setting this up in detail a little bit later <laughs> Seeing 
drummers and other people, other musicians that trigger things, they're stuck with one note. Uh, so uh, this is a system I've, I, I've developed that allows you to uh, trigger notes in precise order. It always goes around in the same order, but you're not restricted uh, to just one note and you're not restricted to one sample. It opens up the whole game. In the future videos, I'm going to be much more in depth about how this whole system works.